This PK focuses on Gregory Ulmer's teletheory and heretics and Cora's relation to my story. Teletheory claims that invention and creativity is possible to teach. As we now have the applicable technology at our disposal whenever we need it as a pedagogical tool, albeit in the form of VHS or beta, according to Teletheory, as keep in mind he published this still applicable work in 1989. To quote from this work, he states, Video permits the institutional dissemination of inventive thinking. Unquote. Ulmer, Teletheory, Grammatology in the Age of Video. He uses the example of my story as a means of Teletheory's primary goal, invention via a place, memory, and the web of connections implicit in a person's cosmological identity, roots, and experiences. My story relies more so on a personal nonfiction as a guide of memory than an analytic linear timeline of life events. The practice of memory and how it is applied to my story relies on one's subjective recollection of subconscious's connection to a place, as well as one's subjective impression of mood regarding said place. Almer coins choreography as a loose definition of this concept. As postmodern as the aforementioned may seem, Ulmer realizes that we need to apply both old and new rhetorics in addressing how our kairos has changed because of technology. Thusly, he includes the classic trivium of rhetoric, which is ethos, pathos, and logos, as well as his own chaotically appropriate topia in discussing his new ideas of teletheory. He uses Derrida's idea of Korra and adapts it to the concept of invention via a technological topos related to memory. Somehow in heretics, he does what many would think as improbable. He creates a space in which both literal and metaphysical ideas can inhabit collaboratively. Regarding Cora, Ulmer states, quote, the strategy of choreography for deconstructing the frontier metaphor of research is to consider the place in its genre and rhetorical terms as a topos. The project is then to replace topos itself, not just one particular setting, but place as such, with Cora, wherever the former is found in the trivium in order to foreground the foundational function of location and thought choral writing organizes any manner of information by means of the writer's specific position in the time and space of a culture unquote 30 page 33 almer uses paradoxical language in the tradition of the old school sophists such as gorgias as well as the new school such as Barthes and Ventaza, when he states that, quote, Cora is an impossible possibility, page 26. More specifically, Ulmer states that, quote, a principle of choral research is to collect what I find into a set unified by a pattern of repetitions rather than by a concept. Electronic learning is more like discovery than proof, unquote, page 56. So, my hunch on this is that he uses discovery more so as a punction kind of satori. I don't like that he uses Derrida's adaptation of punction rather than just using bars straight away, but I have to admit I'm biased here, as I'm quite fond of bars and more familiar with them. So much of bars theory today relates to subjective values and how they are just as valuable as analytical concepts. Because of this, I feel my bias is justified. 
Regardless of who he quotes, though, Ulmer is very much a visionary. How he came up with Teletheory in 1989 is beyond me. Perhaps Plato, whom I'm also biased towards, but in a negative light, and his muses visited him in dreams, but I am doubtful of that. Ulmer's intuitive knowledge of self, being, and humanity is far beyond anything that Plato could concoct.